Hi, it's Stella from Apple University, and this is Stella Short and Sweet for Clip Cut Parts from Renegade Game Studios. The city needs your help. You need to create sets of beautiful parts required to please the mayor. The game plays 1 to 4 players with mechanics such as dice rolling and not roll and write but roll and cut. The game is of light complexity. In clip cut parts, you need to fill 5 park cards with pieces that you cut to make up the parts. Each player starts with a park sheet and 5 park cards with 2 parts face up at the time. At the start of the round, one player rolls a die and that determines how many cuts and how long the cuts you can do on your park sheet that round. For example, rolling this 1, 2, 3 will result in enabling you to cut one square side, then another one for two squares length, and another one for three squares length. Each cut must not combine the same cut to one continuous direction. So the idea is to cut the right shape of what's required of your part cuts. Some areas have requirement of colors or connected squares, other requirements of simple. The game ends when at least a player is able to complete their five park cards, which the player wins. This game is almost a different take from rolling right. You cut instead of marking off your sheet. You cannot undo what you have cut. If you cut something off your park sheet, you must use it. You can't further cut the piece. And if you can't use it, you just crumple it and keep it. This is for tiebreaker. When you complete a park card, it will give you a bonus, like you can immediately cut extra one or two spaces, or ignoring requirement of a color on your park card. It's pretty fun game. I feel like efficiency is the key here. If you like individual puzzle with time mechanics that triggers when someone completes all their five park cards, then this might be for you. So thanks for watching guys. If you have any questions for me, just write in the comment sections below. You would help us by subscribing to Mipple University and hit the bell so you won't miss anything from us. I also share my board games journey on Instagram, so hopefully I'll see you there too. Until next time.